Well, Mondays, let's face it, they're never fun, especially if you had a little too much to drink over the weekend. I don't know why I'm looking at you. <laughs> I should be looking at me. So we thought it'd be a really fun idea to share with you what you can do before, during, and after a few drinks to minimize that dreaded hangover in a segment that we call <laughs> Things to care about. Hello. Now, where were you uh, Saturday <laughs> at like one o'clock when I was getting ready for my event? I know. I'm so. Can I just say to everyone, I'm so proud of you and all the work you put into this the last ten weeks. And I was just saying, I was like, you have to feel like such a relief in a way because you were very stressed out about raising the 50k, and then you, I mean, literally, you almost tripled it. I'm, I am like, I just want to sleep this whole week. Yes. I, and literally just, well, I felt, I mean, because you're, mm -hmm. we're fundraising, you're meeting people, right. you're, it really felt like a, like a, like yes. a true campaign where you're just nonstop going, going, going. Right. So. And wow. for as like vivacious and like welcoming as you are to everyone, that's not really your thing to ask people. No. For, <laughs> that's not, no. That's it not, was you've so You've definitely stepped out of your comfort zone yes. to raise a lot of money. So I did. It's incredible. And thank yes. you for doing and that. I now did, sleep. I, right. And I did need this article because we started <laughs> with pictures and a champagne toast at 3 o'clock on Saturday. Well, that's... So yesterday I was slightly... <laughs> and then we went to the St. Regis, had a nightcap. Oh, nice. So we were... Yes. Yeah. My brother was... They all had a second win. Well, and this, this wasn't meant for as an intervention I or anything not. for you. But there were some interesting... <laughs> things in this article that I didn't think we've heard before. Do you have a go-to um, hangover cure? These are from lifehack.org, oh, by the way, by an okay. author named Brad. And Brad is sharing his, but I don't really, I guess just like sleep when I could, but now that's like a thing of the past. You can't right. really sleep anymore. Exactly. A um, lot of food. Yeah, I don't know. My friend, well, I won't name names, <laughs> okay. um, said that she has these, something she picked up, um, I think the Whole Foods sells them, okay. it's like a patch. So Ooh. you just stick it on your a leg patch. and then it's like, I like filling that. your body with nutrients. Or just have like patches all over. Right? I know, right? Okay, so this one is pretty rudimentary, but it is important and I think a lot of us forget to do it, but to I eat didn't. something beforehand. So you have to eat much. a solid meal before drinking alcohol because it lowers the amount of acetaldehyde in the body. Ooh. This is the chemical, I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, the alcohol is converted to, that is responsible for hangovers. So I would just like to say, dear drug companies, let's find something Thing that just blocks the acetaldehyde yes. in our bodies, and then we can just drink whatever we want. Yeah, but then that's our liver, dangerous. No, that's dangerous. That's, da that's a our bad liver, idea. We'll get, yeah. I'm sorry. I, I should but have no, talked that out okay. before I said it on Well, TV. you were thinking it through, and okay. then you're like, well, never mind. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. So that's interesting. Yeah. Make sure you eat. And, I, and mm -hmm. like even my mom said, I was watching, and you didn't eat a whole lot of dinner because right. <laughs> I was excited and chatty. I and, know. It's hard. Yeah. It is hard. I'm, I, I'm actually, I don't know why I'm saying it's hard. I'm actually, it's fine for me to eat a bunch. But um, <laughs> <laughs> second, second, this one I'd never heard of, prepare with prickly pear, okay? Prickly pear, which is actually, what? if you Google where do you eat prickly pear, there's a ton of restaurants named prickly pear, one in Atlanta on Peachtree. However, it also shows you how to pick a prickly pear, the fruits you can pick and you can get them at the grocery store. But they contain a protein that reduces inflammation, so it's been said that consuming the prickly pear extract hours before drinking alcohol will lower the effects of a hangover. Prickly pear? Yes. I don't think, I, have you guys had prickly pear? I don't think I have. I had prickly pear margarita. Oh, yes. I, yeah, I've had <laughs> yes. one of those now that I think about yes. it. Okay. So just yes. drink prickly does that pear count, Michelle margarita. Yes, it does, Michelle. It balances it out. Mm -hmm. That's what we say. <laughs> Doctors, we play doctors on TV. Yes, yes. It, could, it couldn't hurt. Um, okay, the next one is also something that you've Ooh. probably have heard before, but you need to drink lots of water, okay? Yes. Because the liver needs water to process alcohol. When too much alcohol is consumed, it will turn to other organs to pull water from. Wow. Okay, so and this is why you get headaches. You have to hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I need to do that today. Well, you know, they used to have the rule like one drink, one glass of water. Then some people say one mm. drink, two glasses I didn't of water. Have that. I but didn't. then you're just in the restroom all night. Right. Now, that is true. That is true. You have to pick your battles. But you have to. I need to have a lot. I've had coffee this morning, but I need a lot more water. Well, that's on the list. Yeah. You're not supposed to drink coffee. Oh, we'll no wonder. We'll get to that. We'll get to that. Okay. Minute. Not that you're uh, hungover. <laughs> no, I'm not right now. <laughs> you're but not, but I do need some. Coffee. Yes. No. And no. I would, yeah. No, no, no. I was hanging out watching the Tonys last night. No, no alcohol. Sorry, I didn't mean to insinuate yeah. that. Okay, so also this one's interesting. I thought you were supposed to choo choose clear um, alcohol for what you were wearing, but you should also <laughs> choose That's true. clear liquids because it will, they will help you become less hungover. So like vodka, gin, white rum, tequila. Mm. So these alcohols have higher compounds in them, or 
not not those alcohols other alcohols have, the, have higher compounds in them that are made up of anything but alcohol and water so they bring on inflammation in your body yes it all goes back to the inflammation, inflammation my mom it's really says. the devil so what's happening here i think mm -hmm. i don't know what's it's happening. bad I'm falling apart. <laughs> You're not falling apart. Oh my gosh, Holly Furfer was amazing. roasting me so badly, I was telling you. <laughs> yes. Like about turning 50. <laughs> uh -huh. So she was like, oh, can you make it up on stage all right, old lady? I mean, <laughs> she I didn't even know it. about your knee. No, well, and then I was like, I really oh. can't. Help oh me. gosh. Yeah, yeah. That's I know. Bad. We're it gonna, was funny. We should get you one of those motorized scooters. Well, uh, we'll see what the doctor says today. Okay. Hopefully he'll do a shot. Okay. And yes, you need a shot. You do need I need to see Dr. Lee can hear is what I need. But something um, will help you help me okay are you gonna you. stick around yeah I'm doing the AC